So this is my response video to certain women, which I did really enjoy. I felt like it was a little slow, which I didn't really entirely mind because I felt like it's one of those movies that kind of worked with that slow nature and it kind of wanted the film to be slow in the sense of that's kind of like showing the women's lives. I liked how real they made the women's lives out to be like they're just another person. Like I felt like it was extraordinarily relatable, but it just felt slightly lacking to me if I'm being honest. In the ways that I felt like it was lacking, I more so felt as though maybe I wanted some form of resolution or a means of solution because I felt like all these women were expressing things in society that are very valid like compromising and you know dealing with sexism and different you know workplace environments so I just felt like they had a lot of great things to talk about but it felt like almost as if women can't escape like escape that that experience because there wasn't much of a resolution at the end that made you feel like I hope for the best so I chose the scene specifically with Michelle which I looked up her names which I also felt that their names weren't even really being described in the movie much so at all that I had to look up most of their names um which I also felt like was important to note that the women really didn't have names as if either they kind of represent a whole or that their experiences are so common that they don't need a name. So I went into Michelle's and so this is the scene I chose and I'm going to keep talking about it. I think this scene is essential for me in showing what Michelle is thinking and her family dynamic as she wants to get this stone, this crumbled, broken stone, which I think represents her as a person or her as a woman. She's broken. She wants to put herself back together as much as possible but she wants to rely on a man to help her and even her daughter won't help her. It's just kind of a kind of sad portrait of a mother who is putting her all seemingly said from her husband who said that she's the boss. She's the one that works. She's the one that does this and that and keeps them together. But the dad and daughter outwardly are mean to her and they own that and they recognize it. So I think that this rubble just represents her and her desire to continuously keep putting things back together. And I think it begs the question of how much can a woman hold? It's seemingly so much that they can hold because they just want to be able to put everything back together because they know that no one will do that for them. Her husband outwardly is trying to corrupt that situation and get them to not acquire the stone that they need. So in this sense, a man is hindering how hard that she has to work. So I think that this was a really illuminating scene for me personally. Yeah, that was my interpretation of at least just that one scene and Michelle Williams. And I just thought that her character was really interesting to me. And I just kind of felt like she the most had this bigger kind of representation for mothers, for women, and kind of what women are expected to do and expected to kind of hold within themselves emotionally and metaphorically so I just thought it was a really interesting movie and especially just her character the most and her relationship and dynamic to her family and her daughter um I felt it was really interesting and critical for me so yeah I really enjoyed it